with you, baby, you right You are not for me, goodbye You ain't shit to me Shit to me You ain't shit to me So, I'm going to be doing a vlog for Salah Happy Salah, everybody Check out my henna I was supposed to start yesterday But there was so much work yesterday, honestly I couldn't I couldn't get out of it And even today, sir like i just washed my hijab i just washed my hijab today and like i had to beg my brother and the other one to wait for me if not they would have gone without me Hello. so yeah so yeah um we're, get, we're going for it my brother just stopped to pick his friend who is late but will not talk sha yeah going for it As I've said in my previous videos, I can't really show you us praying. So this is us after the prayer. It's two raka'ah. It's not much. So some people like to leave immediately after the prayer. Some like to wait and listen to khutbah. Khutbah is basically like them preaching, telling you things you should do, things you shouldn't do, and like practices you should maintain and all of that. So yeah, I waited a bit, but then I got, I didn't, I felt weird that everyone was leaving. And so I decided to leave as well. After the Eid prayer, we usually come and wait by the car because there's a crowd and we wouldn't be able to find each other. So that was what we did. But my brother decided to wait and hear the khutbah. So this is us just waiting for him. So when we were kids, my dad used to take all of us for Eid and he would make it compulsory for us to say the Askar, the one I was just reciting, out loud because he said it was the Sunnah of the Prophet. Our Prophet used to do it, so we should be doing it as well. And like he died a year ago, so I like to do it. I did it last year and I did it this year just, you know, to remember him by and because I think it's a good practice and I'm really glad he taught us. So I got back, changed clothes, and decided to join my mom in the kitchen to speed up the cooking process because I was hungry. So now we're not fasting anymore, so everything is quite chill. We can eat. And typically, people take this time out to stuff their faces because now they can eat in the daytime. And to me, I don't really see like a difference between eating in the daytime and eating at night. I feel like it's all the same thing as long as I get to eat. But to some people, like, it actually makes a difference, and that's why they fill their stomachs up. And, you know, sometimes the, like, with the Eid, there's a lot of celebration, so there's different meals. Like, everything is, like, superb, the cooking and all. So that kind of, like, raises the spirits up for eating. We made zobo, we made chin chin, fried rice, some people are going to bring jollof rice and all of it. It's just so nice. There's no big reveal. This is just, it's just me. Hi. If this phone fall, I fall. So yeah, this is my son left it. I should probably do like a full one. Oh, this is my henna. <laughs> I'm chaotic. That's just who I am. So. Every Salah day, we go and we share food for people. So, I'm not the last one, but it's almost as if I'm the last one because I'm always doing last one things and acting like a last one. So, we just call me an honorary last one because I'm the last girl, I, maybe. I don't know. We are who we are. So, my little brother has opted out of serving food in the Salah. So, it's my job now. Someone will kill me, but we'll survive. We'll survive. Oh, 
close to the far side. Off to the next house. My brother and his wife came and they brought food. <laughs> and he brought a chair too. Hello, say hi to the vlog. Hi. Yeah. Wherever you all are. Yes, yes, thank you. Yeah. Here too. So I forgot. I was vlogging and I devoured this food. But yeah, there's more food to come. I'm watching the office, which is so nice. I'm rewatching it actually and I'm already in season three. I don't know. So yeah. So as a lazy girl, which I pride myself on being, I completely forgot to vlog after I had my first meal. I tried sleeping but I couldn't sleep so I was watching the office. I was just watching the office and then I slept off after a while and i woke up and it was the next day so i had my shower um some visitors are coming and it's actually back to work because i have a deadline tomorrow i'm supposed to apply for something so i'm trying to work on that as of now that's basically the goal because like i said the deadline is tomorrow so i have to finish it today and like that's what i'm trying to do hopefully i get it done because i've actually been procrastinating my friend Mokhtar, Mokhtar kept telling me that oh just do it you can do it all this motivation and stuff and i hate motivation and stuff but yeah i guess it was kind of nice of him to do that and yeah now i'm going to try and i'm also reading this book um things things we left behind a romance novel which is just like my guilty pleasure and all so yeah, thank you so much for watching. Hope you had an amazing Eid as well. Yeah, I'm trying to show you my life. <laughs> Hope you had an amazing Eid as well. I wish you the best of luck in all of your endeavors. Share with your friends and family because who wouldn't want to see me? And yeah, have a good one.